Hey there everyone, my name is Nathan and I'm the owner here at Minnesota Mobile Guy. If you're not already familiar with us, we're a business based here in the U.S. state of Minnesota, but we assist customers from all over the world with all sorts of different issues and services on their smartphones, tablets, and other mobile devices. One of the services that our customers most frequently ask us to perform is the removal of the Google Account Lock security feature on an Android device, also known as the FRP lock for factory reset protection. Now, here with us today, we happen to have an Android tablet from the brand On, which is owned by Walmart and sold at their stores. And this is a 10.1 uh, inch screen model. And we'll be able to see more of that later on. But this device does actually have the Google account lock enabled because as we're going through the setup steps here, we can see that we come to the screen that tells us that the device was factory reset. And to continue, we have to either verify the previous user screen lock pin that was used, or if we tap on use my Google account instead, it'll pull up the second option that tells us that, that we can also sign in with the previous Google account that was on the device. So over the years, we've been contacted by tons of customers asking us for assistance with this specific issue on this specific model, usually either because they themselves accidentally got locked out of their own device and couldn't remember or recover their login information after having done a factory reset, or because they purchased the device used from someone on the internet who turned out to be a scammer. So then after the purchase, the buyer discovered the device was locked, and then obviously they're not going to have the previous user's login information. And in those cases, the seller has usually long since disappeared, since again, it is a scam that happens a lot these days in the buying and selling of used mobile devices. But we're making this video here to show any interested customers that we do offer a service to be able to get the lock removed from this exact model without having to have the previous user's login information. Removing the lock is a procedure that we do directly to the device while it is plugged into a computer. And the great thing about this is that it's something that can be done for just about anyone anywhere in the world. So you don't necessarily need to be located here in our local area in order for us to be able to do this for you. You would just need to have a decently powerful Windows PC along with a fast and stable internet connection. And we can connect right to your computer through the internet in order to to perform the exact same procedure that we just did here with this one. So actually before starting the video, we had already done 99% of the work necessary to remove the lock just so that we can keep this video as short as possible. We just left it in place right before the last step so that you could all see that the device was indeed locked as proof that we can actually do this so that you know that we're not trying to scam anyone here. There's no trickery being pulled or anything like that. So now that that last step has been performed and the device is restarting, we should be able to see that we can get all the way through the initial setup steps without running into that Google lock screen. So back on the initial screen here, we're going to wait while it runs through this part here. We do not need to copy apps and data. And ask us about using the device. We're just going to hit, uh, we're just going to choose adult. And now here on the Google sign in screen, you'll notice the message has changed. So whereas previously it was asking for the specific previous account that was used on this device, now it's letting us sign in with any Google account or even create a new one if we want. So that is a great indication that the lock has been removed. We're gonna go ahead and skip through all the rest of the stuff though, just to verify that we can actually get all the way to the home screen to actually use the tablet. Okay, there we go. We've got the home screen loading up here. We have access to all of the apps and settings and features, and this is just like a brand new device that never had the lock on there. While we're here, I'm gonna pop into the settings just to show you exactly what we're working with. So when we go down to About Tablet, the device name up top here has On's 
model number, which is usually a random series of digits, starting with one followed by triple zeros. So when we tap on the model and hardware, that's all that really pops up as the model. But if you look up information about this specific device, it's an Android tablet made by On, and it also seems to be the third generation of their devices as they come out with a new one every year. So this one seems to be the third generation released in the year 2022. So if you have this exact on model tablet with the FRP lock enabled and need help getting that removed, we would love to help you out with that. So go ahead and get in touch with us. All of our contact information will be right down in the video description here. And we'll also put a slide at the end of the video that has all of our info there as well. While you're here, make sure to check out some of the other videos that we have here on our channel as we offer a lot of different services for thousands of models of mobile devices and I'm sure you'll find something there that interests you. While you're here, uh, also hitting that subscribe button will enable you to be notified of all of the new videos and services that we're constantly adding and putting up, just like we're doing here with this one. Y para todos ustedes hispanohablantes, nosotros también hablamos español, así que ustedes también nos pueden contactar sin duda. Thanks so much for watching, everyone, and have a great rest of your day.